There we go! Hello everyone! Welcome, welcome! Hope everyone's doing well. Welcome back to Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Let me just quickly wait for the alerts to come up and then I could do my little silly ping. There we go! Awesome. Regulation G! <laughs> we finally got the rule set for it. Uh, it's a restricted format. Uh, we're starting with the restricteds already. Uh, one restricted per team. It is a one restricted format. Uh, and I already have a team ready for it. Because I wanted to just get hard into practicing today. And to start, uh, I decided to... I, I, I always... Like, I knew when a regulate... Like, after seeing Chi Yu and seeing, obviously, Kyurem coming back, I knew for a fact that I wanted to run a... Kurem White and Chi Yu team. Because in my head, the combination of Kurem and Chi Yu is massive, right? This is like the most tryhard team I've ever fucking made. Like, this is, this is like literally super tryhard. Like, if Incineroar was here instead of Landorus, which I, I personally do prefer Landorus in this team, it just gives us more options. Um, It, 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 it would have been like super fucking tryhard. Uh, every Pokemon, except Ogapon, has a spread move of some kind. Like, the idea is just damage, 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 but the Aurora Veil is going to help us, like, survive hits. Hey, funny, nice. I hope you're having a good time with that. Like, we, we don't have form of speed control. That is the biggest downside with this team, but I'm hoping with the amount of bulk that we're able to provide... Both with, like, Follow Me, and Intimidates, and obviously the big one being Aurora Veil. In my head, we should be able to eat enough hits. Now, uh, Kyurem White here, uh, I was considering Terra Ice. However, I do personally prefer Terra Poison. It's just a lot more nice to have. At least in practice for me. Uh, just so, you know, I don't want to get a, you know, it, it, it's just nice. It's just nice. But, uh, yeah. Was playing Singularity? Hell yeah, dude. So we're just gonna hop straight to the ladder. Like, obviously the new ladder isn't out yet. It isn't out till next month. I thought it was gonna be this month. I was under the, I was under the assumption that it was gonna be this month, but it's next month. Um, but Kiram White here is going to be my personal play. Obviously, with the casual ladder, you're gonna get light. Ah, what the heck? What the heck? That's so mean. That's so mean, Mimic. I hope you're well. Yo, Silver with the 31 months. Let's go. Hell yeah. Can't stay long today, but hope you have some good games. Hails 12 Hailstone Cat. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Silver. Thank you so much. I said I never said it was nice, tiny fish. Tiny. I'm 13 feet long. The heck? Also very based funny. And it looks like we're already running into some other fellow reg, uh, reg G team. So we at least get some solid practice. Um, I feel like King Gambit's a really good lead for them. So I'm thinking if they're going to start Gambit, I'm thinking starting with these two is a good one. Next! Four foot negative three. I'm 5'10 IRL. What the heck? What the heck? I measure your height from the spike on your head to your waist. Your The tail doesn't count in my eyes. Bruh. 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 Um, what else works in this scenario? I'm thinking of putting these guys in the back. Does that look good? Yee, yeah, that that looks good to me. Yee. Yeah. <laughs> Hi Adam. Hi Zach. Hale, did you know that the scene was cut from the English dub with the Bakugan dance on a cake? That's crazy. That's crazy. It's like counting the might of a hunky when stand monkey when it stands on its tail. Bruh. Okay. Not 
the worst start. Because, I mean, we, I, I see, uh, don't ask me, all right? My brain is just burr, all right? Don't ask me. My brain just doesn't like working. It's not a fan of working, unfortunately. Hey, by, I, by all means, Adam, that's not a bad height. Most of, like, my IRL friends uh, who are dudes are also around that height. I wish I was shorter. I'm 6'2", and buses, trains, and planes here are not nice for my knees. That's valid. That's so valid. Iron defense? Okay. Oh boy, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be so much fun! <laughs> I can't wait to ruin the VGC in my game. Oh boy, oh boy. Also, ow, what the fuck? That's rude and cringe. Hey, Shadzi, how you doing? Hmm. I fixed your boobs? You fixed them? That's crazy. That's awesome. <laughs> That's awesome. Also, man, Zamazent is a lot faster than I thought it would be. God damn. If I can get Veil, I should be fine. Yeah, I saw it. It's hilarious. Like, that shit's funny. <laughs> that shit fucking funny. If I can just get Veil up, I should be fine. Gotta attach them to your body well before I <laughs> let them jiggle. <laughs> I mean, I would hope they would be attached, you know? What, you wanted Spider-Man? What are you, Cringe Silver? SMH. One fucking Spider-Man. Ew. Imagine. <laughs> Imagine. Okay, this Zamazenta is going to become an issue. I need to get rid of it. Just let them drop and they fall off your... <laughs> oh, my God. Hell yeah, Adam. Hell yeah, man. If I do... <laughs> nah, glue's optional. Don't, don't, the, the glue's optional. It was never required, you know? Never was, never have been. Blue glue. <laughs> yeah, that's how the booba sticks on, you know? No, we're not feeding me glue. Shadzi's putting glue on the booba. There's a difference. There is a difference, chat. If Hale's booba was removable, she would have lost them by now. Bruh, you can't call me out like that. That's so rude. Actively rude. Yeah, they're like my favorite combo, dude. They're such silly little guys. Of course, that was the crit. Honestly, I think Curum White will be fun. Because, uh, it's Curum White. Are you fucking kidding me? The fish will be fine. He'll be fine. 
Durham White's crazy, dude. 175 special attacks, insane. Like, just saying that is like, what the hell were they thinking? Like, what the fuck? And we still have Veil. What if Fog was on the field? That'd be so sad. Also gonna have, like, 15 toggles? Aw, oh, hell yeah. Thank god- Thank god I got, like, my stream deck now, so... Balance? So true. Hey, Glaze. Hey, Blade. How you two doing? I mean, hey, like I said, I got my stream deck now. I actually have buttons. Enjoy your lurk, man. Enjoy ye lurk. I'm, I'm doing pretty good. Right now, we're just doing some reg G practice. Of course, it was a crit. Of course. I cry every day. Daily flex over. Yeah, Adam out here being like, Yeah, I've been following you for like seven years. I'm, pre I'm pretty sure if like Songo did that as well, it'd be pretty pretty funny. Five regular toggo toggles, seven E-bombs, three tum-tums. Oh, let's fucking go. Who's your longest sub? Uh, Gabe. I think, I know he's at like three plus years right now. And I know you're the second longest silver. To my knowledge. To my knowledge, after all. I could just be fucking lying, so. I <laughs> take him out. Yo, we got a Claude Sire, chat. Chat, we got a Claude Sire. Bro, this dude's so based. This guy is so based. The dude's got a clawed sire, guys. Most based individual. Watch him not use it. If he doesn't use the clawed sire, he's a fucking coward. If there is no clawed sire, then this dude's a coward. Dude, clawed sire is awesome. Also, Shadzi, approximately how much do I owe you for uh, for everything, by the way? Like, so far. Just so I can get the money ready. 1,000? Shit, you right. At this point, I've probably spent close to over 1,000 like on like this model. I know I've definitely spent over 1,000. Probably getting closer to 200 on models. You know, if Game Freak weren't cowards, they would have had Ting Lu and Ferrothorn. Shit, you're right. Talks your bank details for the memes. Ah, fuck you, right? Ah, oh, God. I got, like, shit in my eye. Alright, Smeargle's gonna fake out. I already know this bitch is gonna click fake out. Which, if he's gonna click fake out. Yeah, I can work with this. Because I can't protect. Like, I, that's that, like, Urshifu's right there. Like, I literally can't click protect against this guy. Like, it's insane. Okay, I made the right call. I made the right call. We're good. We're good. We're good. We made the call. <laughs> we we got it right. All right, it was going, it was go <laughs> it was going to be the nine tails. Chat, if your social security, no, no, chat. <laughs> No, no, Silver, you cannot ask people for your ba for their bank details. No, Silver. Oh, my God. 
I need to buy a new game soon. Got given a hundred for Easter for my parents for games or whatever I want to buy it with. Uh, just commission me, lol. I'm kidding. Or uh, nah, I'm kid kidding. Just a friendly guy who wants to know your mother's maiden name. What's sus about that? Bro. <laughs> Bro. Alright, it's gonna hurt. I already know that's gonna hurt. Unless. You know what? We take those. Live. It would be funny, I think. Damn it. You know what? That's fine. It's fine. Another one will, like, next turn, like, it fucking dies. So, like, it's all good. Do I just bring out... Yeah. Yeah. In my head, I'm like, do I do it? And I'm like, yeah. Yeah, I do it. Yeah, I do it. It'll be funny. Ha! I knew it. 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 I knew it! Also, the fuck you mean Wmon for real? Hale must work at Starbucks with how often she messes up my name. Hey, 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 listen, all right? We all make mistakes, and my mistakes is speaking. I never claim to be good at speaking, okay? Can't bully me for that shit. That's mean. That's mean. Check this fucking shit out! Fun lore about myself, Smeargle's my most hated Pokemon, and it's not because of comp? What, what's, what's, what's the lore reason? Why do you hate Smeargle? What's made you to despise this little bastard? I mean, I think it's a little bastard, but you know, what, what's, what's your lore reason? The shiny version ran away, ran away, ran away, ran away, ran away from me when I was 14 in the safari zone. I can fucking speak, God. This was hard gold? Damn, that's tragic, dude. <laughs> Adam got COVID and lost their taste, clearly. No, chat, we're not gonna bully each other over Pokemon takes. Also, lads, I have a poll going on on my YouTube channel if y'all wanna go vote on that. It's pretty much just asking what peeps want me to post, like, community-wise over, uh, over on the YouTubes. If you guys wanna go check that out, I have that going on right now. I have yet to get COVID as well. Oh, God. Oh god, it's a Kyogre team! Oh joy, oh glee, it's a Kyogre team! Hmm. This should be fun. It's not a Kyogre team if you kill it. Shit, you right. Do you know what's fun about this chat? Ogapon. <laughs> Ogapon fucking shits on Kyogre, and it's not even funny. Farigraph is silly. Farigraph is just a silly Pokemon. Because, like, it's, it's like, stat-wise, it's just okay, but, like, the utility it brings is, like, insane. Like, I, I think it's so silly. Alright, do I use my Terra already? That's the question. I think he's 100% gonna go for, like, a Surging Strikes. And he's gonna go for Tailwind, meaning he's gonna outspeed me. Yes, do it memes. Actually, wait, I can do this. This one-shots. 
Fuck it. Fuck it, we ball, we'll burn the Terra. We ball. Okapon Wellspring just shits on so many Pokemon, it's really funny. Like, it's really funny how just this Pokemon says, nah. Oh! Oh, they're not going. Oh, they cl they're clicking Bleak Win. Oh, they're just going straight for a Bleak Win. Oh, they're trying to get rid of Ogapon before Kyogre. Shit! Alright, that's scary. Oh, that's scary. Oh, of course you get the double speed drop, you absolute fucking bastard. You absolute fucking bastard. Hmm. Drain the entire ocean. Kyogre cannot exist. So true. Yeah, they knew, they knew for a fact that Ogapon just shits on Kyogre. Hmm. Hey, they're just clicking Bleak Win. They're not going for Tailwind. Why? Like, my brain's trying to comprehend why are they just not clicking Tailwind. Hmm. If I bring in... Okay, I think I, I think I can... I think I click buttons. Choice Specs? Shit, you're right, you're right. Yeah, Choice Specs Tornadus, the ultimate flex. I mean, I respect it. It's funny. I get my brain. I'm like, okay. You clicked, you clicked Bleak Win twice. Still not better than Life Orb Shit Ninja. The strong. It would be so funny if, like, unironically, someone just like, fuck it. Life Orb Shit Ninja. I ain't a coward. They should buff Shed Ninja by making it so, like, it ignores, uh, Life Orb. I'm just saying. <laughs> With Final Gambit. True. True, true, true. You bitch! You bitch! Okay, if you click Water Spout, it's doing jack shit. Oh, you're going for Origin Pulse. Okay. Hmm. Well, this gotten a lot harder now. Hmm. What's the game plan? Oh, I get Ivy Cudgel. I get Ivy Cudgel Earth Power. Especially if they go for like like the main issue is if they did click tailwind. Yeah, there it is. Thank you, Silver. I'll see you later, man. That's totally on the yoga pond. It's not. Okay. Okay. Your sash tornadus? What the actual hell are you cooking? I mean, it's working, but more like, good lord. I have cudgels for the trainer's knees. Shit, you right, you right. Guys, check out the knees, bro. You don't need them. If I could just get, like. Ah, oh, fuck, I like it. A lucky unironically might like lose us the game. I 
I need a miss. Tornadus is gonna click Bleak Win. In game, I need a miss. I need a miss, game. Game? Please. I need a miss. You know, Pokemon's really a dog shit game if you think about it. I mean, like, you know, this game kind of sucks. Can't miss in the rain, dummy? That's Hurricane. That's Hurricane. Sir, that's Hurricane. Kind of a game for babies? I know, right? I know, right? But dirt. Oh. Well, I just double checked. Yeah, okay. So, okay, so it has the exact same effect. It has the exact same effect. I I I, I just Google. I just Googled it. I went to Bulbapedia. I thought I could fact check your ass. Uh, and I'm like, oh wait, no. Okay, so it does get affected by rain. I thought it was hurricane. Fake fan boo this fish? That's so rude. That's so rude. Like, what the fuck, bro? What the fuck? Bulbapedia fake. Shit, you right. Oh, God. More Kyogre. Ow. We're going to be running into a lot of Kyogre. I can already tell. Ow. 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 Rude. Stop throwing shit at me. Oh my god. Fucking asshole, man. Oh, excuse me. Hmm. This looks good. We'll do this. We'll do this and hope for the best. God, I love coffee. God, ca coffee. <laughs> I love the little Periscuta. That's funny. Little itty bitty fish. Okay. Works for me. Works for me. Now, I could Terra Blast. I could U-Turn. But I think going for Stomping Tantrum is a solid play. I could also bring in Esther, but the main issue is the Archaladon. If I can find a way to bring in... Like, if I just get rid of the Archaladon, which I think the Archaladon is our play. Though I think the chances of that Ogapon going for a Follow Me are pretty likely. So, under the assumption they click follow me. I'm just gonna go for stomping tantrum. Oh, okay. Uh, spiky shield. That works. Yeah, I can just start, I can start clicking stomping tantrum on the arch out on. Yo! Alright, crit definitely mattered. Alternatively, no predictions, just hit. Shit, you're right, you're right, you're right. You're right, you're right, you're right. All right, we take a little bit of chip. That's unfortunate, but, you know, it's fine. We, like, one-shotted their Arch Aladon, so. Bring in Kyogre so I can get rid of the rain. That'd be puggers. Yep, there it is. There's that bastard. Yeah, I just start clicking Horn Leech. I think I just Horn Leech for free, to be honest. I four times resist any, like, water moves they click. This will get rid of their boost, so I don't have to deal with those. Unless he goes for Terra Poison again, but I'm not sure if, like, Terra Poison's the one that everyone's running. I see. Okay. Sure, buddy. 
Sure, buddy. Rocky helmet. Let's go. <laughs> Listen, I'm going to be honest, I kind of forget that this thing has water absorb. Like, legit. I'm not even bullshitting. I genuinely forget this thing has water absorb. Like, I, I, I'm not... Nice. I, I genuinely forget this thing has water absorb. I don't use Ogapon. I know it's a good Pokemon, but I don't use it. Like, it's one of those Pokemon that, like, I know is good. I know it's objectively good. It's why I'm running it on this team. Because it just fit, it, it slots in perfectly. But it's the fact that I just don't use it. So I'm like, oh, yeah, you know, I eat it. Oh, wait, no, yeah, I have Water Absorb. I mean, it's casual. These don't really matter. Oh, yeah, I gotta get my Q up. I almost forgot to turn on my Q. Oh, I had a queue going for over 100 hours. That's funny. There we go. We got a new queue open. What the... This is an in-game team. That's an in-game team. This is an in-game team. Hey, Abdul. How you doing? Okay. Uh, if that's an in-game team, I think probably starting... Yeah. Yeah. I mean, listen, man. Whenever you run into... Like, obviously, it's the casual ladder. You're gonna run into way more in-game teams. It's just really funny when you do, though. Right? It's really funny. Because I'm here trying to practice and then like little Timmy like walks up with his with his mons and it's the funniest shit. Like it's the funniest shit, man. Why is the box glowing? Pokemon, Pokemon. The battle hasn't even started yet and you've already like you already have a bug. Buddy. Buddy. Hmm. Who's the more threatening? Maridon can't really hurt me. I think I get rid of Iron Moth and then I take care of the Maridon. I think I take care of the Moth. And before this is a real meta team that you don't know about? Shit, you're right. <laughs> the crit, yeah, crit mattered, guys. The crit mattered on the Iron Moth. <laughs> Let's go! The Maridon is dead weight! <laughs> oh no, bros! My fourth time's weak Moth died! It's Jover! Oh my god, anyway. I get my veil up, I click blizzard, you, we have fun here. Oh no, bros. The Maridon. <laughs> the Maridon's gonna charge. And I got hit by a wave crash. Do you not have Moxie? Please don't have Moxie, be so funny. Okay, they at the very least got Moxie on their starter. It would have been so fucking funny if they didn't, though. Oh, my God. Imagine naming your character your Twitch handle. I know, right? Imagine. Hold on. Who do you have in the back? Okay, so Blizzard is safe, and I Draco Meteor... The, the dock. You know who else got hit by a wave crash? My mom! 10% chance to freeze. It'd be really funny. Alright, we got him. <laughs> oh no, bros. 
my, 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 my Equiquavo went down. Nice. You hacked in your fucking Torterra. Are you proud of yourself, buddy? Are you proud of yourself, buddy? You fucking proud of yourself? Yeah. You proud? You you proud of yourself, bros? Dude was running a fucking hacked Torterra in Gen Nine. Bro, this game is the fucking easiest to get not only competitive Pokemon, but shinies. You were that lazy? Like, come on, man. It takes like four hours if you have an outbreak. Just buy the DLC? Yeah, like, come on, dude. Like, come on, dude. Just fucking buy the DLC. You have 35 bucks? Ask, ask mommy. Now, this is what we were expecting. Oh boy, this is a hard sun team. Now the question is, if do they start sun? Sun. Four hours feels like you're highballing it with an outbreak. I mean, I feel like four hours you can guarantee a shiny, right? Like obviously outbreaks, especially if you have Herbamistica. Oh, you're getting that shiny super fast. But if it's just an outbreak. I feel like four out like you will reasonably get it within four hours. Is like how I would say like yeah that that I'd say that's pretty reasonable to say. Yeah, this looks pretty good. I might start us open my Pokemon Scarlet and get the D uh, and get the DLC. On that, just to get Raging Bolt and Gouging Fire. You look lively today. I'm having a great time, Abdul. I'm having a great time. Uh, I have... I don't exactly know if the bug's been fixed. I don't exactly know. I, I, I need... I have Pokemon Scarlet. I need to get the DLC for it. And I also, like... I need to actually play my copy of Scarlet. I keep saying I'll get around to it. I just haven't yet. Ah, eject back. Smart, honestly. Bruce Lee. Coridon. Alright, cool. I'm getting rid of your son. Fuck that. Nah. Nah. I'm not dealing with the sun. Get that shit out of here. Get that shit out of here, buddy. I expect a lot of, like, the Pokemon I, I, I guarantee we're probably going to see a lot of in Regulation G. We're probably, at least ladder-wise, obviously tournaments are way different to ladder. I feel like we're going to see a lot of Maridon. Coridon feels like pretty likely as well. Just because of the Paradox Pokemon and all of that. Um, Ky Kyogre o and Groudon always feel like they're just going to forever just be around. Like, we're never going to lose those guys, no matter. <laughs> like, those guys are sticking, you know? As, mu as much as we, like, go, like, you know, it'd be nice to not deal with them. Like, we're, we're, they're sticking, you know? They're, they're staying around. Fuck. My damn, my damn snow! My damn snow! Ah, tragic. GG. <laughs> tragic. My snow, it's gone. Can we also talk about how that one, like, was it like snow, uh, not a snowscape. What's the, um, 
What's the pivoting move that sets up snow? But, like, for whatever reason, it was a fucking... Like... Chilling reception? Yeah. Why the fuck was that a Slow King exclusive? Slow King's not even, like, related to snow. Like, the hell happened there? Because it's funny. I mean, it, it is pretty fucking funny. I won't lie. But, like, what? Huh? I don't get it, man. Slow King is based on a comedian, from what I remember. I mean, that's kind of funny. But it's more like, huh? Why, why is that the signature move, though? Like, why make Chilling Reception a signature move? Is what I want to know. Like, if Chilling Reception was on, like, actual ice types... Like, that'd be huge. We <laughs> the dude's name is Don Dozo. That's amazing. That's actually amazing. Yeah. Mm. I honestly, uh, I wonder, uh, honestly, Coridon will probably re replace the turtle on most sun teams. But I wonder if the electric train is going to be useful enough. It will be. Uh, Maridon is actually fucking insane. And at least in singles, there is a genuine, like, discussion of banning Maridon to anything goes. Because the damage output of Maridon is insane. For context, right? In Mar When electric train is up in... Because, uh, yeah, no. First of all, the, the, the iron Pokemon finally get a their abilities to work. Right? But not only that... The main thing with uh, Maridon is when Electric Train's up, it gets a 1.33333 times boost to damage without an item. You plop an item on, which choice choice spec seems to be the most popular option. Electro Drift gets boosted by Electric Terrain, and if it's super effective, the damage, I believe, is doubled. The damage output of Maridon is absurd. Like, it is genuinely absurd. Uh, and, like, so what I've seen, Maridon is, like, probably going to be, like, the top, in top five restricted bonds. Possibly top three. Like, top three, like, could potentially happen for Maridon. Like, it is genuinely insane. And Coridon, obviously, like, setting up Sun is huge. Like, they're both just huge damage dealers. Uh, also, this is another in-game team. Like, without a doubt, this is another in-game team. Yeah, we'll do that. Like, Iron Paradox-wise, like, a lot of them were mostly, like, you had to either boon your booster energy, right? You had to boot. You had to burn your booster energy, or you had to because like there are decent iron Pokemon. Iron Boulder is pretty solid. Like Iron Hands is the biggest one. Iron Bundle is another big one. Both Iron Crown and Iron Boulder are really like they have their uses. And obviously the other ones are a lot like weaker. They were used to, like during Regulation B. But who knows? Maybe with the fact that. Karai, like, like, not, uh, Maridon finally can activate their abilities without burning an item. Could actually make these mons more usable. Also, I already know what the, this guy is gonna try and go for. He's gonna go for Lava Plume. But Maridon is just genuinely insane. Then I know there's Terrapagos. I know there's, like, a lot of discussion on... Terrapagos and how that's gonna go. Because, like, Terra, for those who are unaware, Terrapagos just used Pinchurkin. Shit, you right. Violet finally getting a W with version exclusives. Genuinely, like, obviously, Sun, like, you have Torkoal. But the issue with Electric Terrain is that we didn't get a new Electric Terrain setter, which I genuinely think 
was cringe because you had pinchurkin and that was it unless you used manual electric terrain which I, I experimented a bit with it was all right like it was okay hey red king hey chaos how you two doing like it was it was okay like it wasn't necessarily good it was just it was fine it was it was fine but like nothing necessarily worth running. Uh, we're practicing for Regulation G Chaos. It's a uh, it's an I it's a Snow Curum White team with Chi Yu Ogapon Nine Tails, uh, Fluttermane, and did I say Ogapon? I pr probably have. I, I I don't remember, but pretty much this is the team. Well, this with Ogapon and um. Letter main. I think honestly, if I just click like, yeah, I don't even think I need to swap. I think I can just click Blizzard Overheat. Or Aurora Veil's great, dude. If they gave Electivire and Mag Mortar like Electric Terrain and Drought, that would have genuinely been fucking massive. Because both of them are shown up by their pre-evos, Magmar and Electabuzz, because of, like, follow me, uh, Eviolite. If they genuinely gave Magmortar, and especially Electivire, uh, Electric Train, it would have given them something. Like, I'm not gonna act like Electivire would suddenly be become, like, top tier, but giving it, like, giving it access to something like that would have genuinely been massive to it. Also, hey... Hey, Dayden, how you doing? Like, Electivire would have had a chance if they genuinely gave it Electric Train. And I do think Electric Train would have been, like, pretty rad. Simply buff Pinchurkin? Shit, you right. Pinchurkin is a silly little guy. <gasps> oh, excuse me. I love the little squishy, squishy ball Pokemon. They're really funny. I mean, like, defensively, it's good outside of the HP. Like, if they give it more HP, if you become bulkier, it would be funny. Nice, Zach. By the way, uh, lads, the battle queue is open. Uh, preferably, I would like to practice more Regulation G if you guys have Regulation G teams. But they're not required. I am willing to obviously, you know, throw in some silly viewer battle shenanigans and all of that. Like, obviously, you know. Because I won't lie, like, obviously, like, Regulation F, I didn't do a lot of experimenting with, but I do want to do a lot of experimenting with G. I do want to, I do want to mess around with that. Man, this guy's cooking something. Okay. Uh, Defiance, funny. Defiance, a very silly thing for them. And because of that, I'm not I'm not bringing Tony. Tony's nice. It's not happening, Chief. I'm not I'm not bringing Tony. All right. I see two defiant users. I'm good. Like yeah, it could be an in-game team. This does look like it's probably an in-game team with like a kid probably wanting like wanting to get into competitive. But it doesn't feel like... I don't know. Maybe he's cooking. He could be cooking. I don't know. It's the casual ladder. Anything's possible. They gave Ogapon with Horn Leech. All the boosts like max attack, nature, grassy terrain. Thanks to terrain recovery. Alola Ninetales could, ta uh, could tank two Horn Leeches. If it was Terra Water, Alola Ninetales. Oh hell yeah. Like, I, I, I think Aurora Veil is just nice. It's a nice option. Hi, Aria. How you doing? Ow. Meanie. Hi, Ray J. How you two doing? Feels like everyone's coming in, like, pairs today. It feels like whenever new people show up, it's always, like, two new viewers at the same time today. It's very funny. Like, it's very funny to me. Nothing wrong. I'm just pointing out an observation that I find to be rather silly. Like, 
Veil's just nice, especially with the snow buff. It just makes Alolan Ninetales so bulky. And it helps a lot. Okay, this guy's going for, like, Drain Punch, probably. <laughs> Yo, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Tragic. Hey, Hale, I'm trying to make my two posters stick to a wall. Uh, when in doubt, um... When in doubt, gum. I'm kidding, by the way, but it'd be funny. It, it, this is probably an in-game team. Because of Cross Chop. The terrifying Cross Chop, probably. Is what I'm going to assume. Nice, Titan. Nice. <laughs> Damn, you got a Bowsette poster? Fucking gel it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my lord. Double Blizzard should kill. Especially if one Blizzard is coming from, uh... Yeah. True, true. I got a raid, a, a Adamant Water Annihilate with five IVs in all but special attack. That's amazing. That's amazing. You have nice tits. <laughs> Thank you. I grew them myself. Well... I, I, I had like a pipe bomb in my mailbox that helped grew them, but you know, I got I got them. <laughs> oh. No, I, I got them. Oh god. Yeah, that thing was going down. There's no way it was fucking living. I love clicking blizzard. I love clicking Blizzard. <laughs> it's really funny. <laughs> oh. God, it's such a mood. I mean, what? Sorry, my brain just dissolved for a second. It was crazy. Mini joke, Hail Lore idea. Hail gets mad at a Pokemon match, throws the game at the wall, gets Isekai into a Pokemon game. <laughs> Lamau. I mean, canonically, Hail is a Pokemon fan. Like, that. that is genuinely canon. It is generally canon that Hale is a Pokemon fan. Like, I've been slowly working more and more at, like, Hale lore, but in, like, a funny way. Yo, we're fighting him again! <laughs> Lamau! What's up, buddy? I'm back! Oh my god. We're back! <laughs> Hello, Tristan! <laughs> Ready? We gonna do that 2 out of 3? I can't believe we got a 2 out of 3 on the ladder. Let's fucking go. Oh my god. Yo, chat. I'm not anime. Yo. We got the Tauros. Bet. Bet. I'm getting rid of the Frigoraph. I'm going for Veil. Imagine being a mermaid, being reincarnated as a car battery. No, chat. There will not be a car battery. Stop throwing car batteries in the ocean, chat. They're not good for the fish. They do not charge eels. No matter don't listen to the propaganda that Gabo is trying to give you. I mean, this entire game has a phenomenal soundtrack. 
Like, Gen, Gen 9 is phenomenal music. We got a nice veil up. Perigarath is dead. Very silly. I'm about to get hit by a raging bull. And I'm living. Oh shit, that destroys screens. I didn't know that destroyed screens. I I didn't know Raging Bull destroyed screens. Okay then. That's a bit of an issue. I'm wondering how like if this will kill. Let's find out. I'm gonna do a little bit of I'm sure it will. But like, you know. I think it's funnier to test it. Now is this overkill? Probably. But it's funny. Damn. That was the crit on Tauros? Oh, it was sashed. Okay. I was like, there's no way it lived. Oh, shit. Anger point. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> it's, got, it's got anger point, chat. Oh, no. Gang reborn as a siren would be funny. I mean... I was always born a fish. I wasn't born a mermaid. I got again a pipe bomb in my mailbox and whoopty freaking do. I I I I got booba and my ass grew. So here I am, Lamau. Yo, nice King Gambit. It would be a shame if I uh, if I clicked a blizzard. <laughs> Oi, howdy. It would be a shame if I clicked Blizzard and killed the Tauros. La Ma! I I love clicking Blizzard. They could have replaced Freeze with Frostbite. They could have, and they actively chose not to. That's on Game Freak. That one's on Game Freak. That one's on Game Freak. Oh my god. I can think of only one counter to your team. And what would that be? And what would that be? I mean, if we're talking Jason Momoa Aquaman, then I ain't complaining. Alright? Like, god damn. Ain't snitching? What the fuck, bro? I thought we were friends. Oh my god. Listen, it, Jason Momoa, Aquaman, alright, that's all I'm saying. Like, like, god damn, bro. God damn. <laughs> what do we got here? Okay. They're, they're cooking. They got a superior and a Charizard. That is certainly choices. I mean, I bring Lando. Bring probably Ogapon. Yeah. Because, I mean, if they start, like... If it's a Jack Pack Torkoal, which is probably... If, if it's a competent team, they probably are running a Jack Pack, right? It's funny to me how, like, useful a Jack Pack can be. Hey, Star. Okay, so I click Rock Slide. Chat, I know what I must do. I insta lock Rock Slide. Even if you tear it, it's gonna hurt, buddy. 
This is this is this is a uh... ah dragon. It's still gonna hurt, dude. It's gonna click spiky shield. Go for the ogre pawn. I think it'd be funny. Heat wave. Okay. It's just heat wave spam. God damn. That did a decent chunk right there. Do this. This should be fine. I mean, hey, man, I hope for the best, Star. I hope for the best, man. Sometimes days be like that, and that's okay, you know? Uh, no, I'm dumb. I, 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 I'm dumb. Unfortunately, I'm what they call stupid. I own Doom Eternal Dighton. Uh, I love, I love 2016 Doom. That was a genuinely phenomenal game. Um, I have yet to get around to playing more Eternal, though. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I'm assuming they're probably going to bring in Torkoal. That would be my assumption. I'm going to hope they don't, but you know. Oh, they brought in Chiyu. Oh, I can work with this. I've played Fossil Fighters once. My friend uh, had a copy back in the day that I played, and that was fun. So I have played it before. God damn, bro. I'm losing to the fucking Charizard team. Tragic. I have no idea which one. I just knew I played one of them back in the day. If the Tailwind could run out, that'd be great. Damn, they got one more turn. They got one more turn, man. Hmm. They got one more turn. Let me get speed. Yep, speed. Yeah, that would be a GG unless it conveniently misses. Because, like, the only way we could somehow win this is if they somehow, like, miss. Which I'm just assuming they're clicking Dazzling Gleam Heat Wave. So the chances of us actually like winning are pretty low. Or Moonblast, okay. I need the Heat Wave to miss. It'd be pretty rad. No, all right, GG. Yeah, Tailwind wasn't running out, so it is what it is. It's casual ladder, so it's all good. <laughs> Like, if it wasn't Flutter Speed, maybe, maybe, I'm assuming that was probably Specs Charizard is what I'm going to assume. Because Specs Charizard makes sense to me. Especially if Heatwave was doing that much. 
Like that was like a what? Two shot on I think it was a two shot on uh on Insin. Something like that. That was insane. That was like literally five turns. Which like god damn. What do we got here? Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Ah, I got you, Dyson. Got him. Gotcha, gotcha. Okapon, Wellspring, uh, Amoongus, Grimmsnarl, Mewtwo. Mewtwo's the thing I'm super curious about. I'm curious what they got for Mewtwo. Iron Boulder is a little scary. They don't have any way to get rid of the weather. Like, the main thing I see here is that they could, they could taunt with Grimmsnarl. Though Grimmsnarl doesn't necessarily run taunt. Usually it's like Thunder Wave or Scary Face, something for speed control. Unless it's like the fake out fake tears set. Because I know like, I know that's one. Hmm. Let's see. I want to do this. I want to get my bulk up. If I Terra Water, obviously I lose the fire weakness, so Sacred Fire doesn't hurt as much. Hear me out, an Applin regional form based on the evasive species known as the Apple Snail? What's an Apple Snail? Colonel, there are children here. Yo, Shulk with the now. raid! Thank you for the raid! Can we get a shout out, lads? Huh, this is an interesting little fella. Huh. Can I offer you a nice egg in these trying times? I could go for an egg. I actually uh, had some eggs this morning. It's good shit, good shit. Good shit, good shit. Good shit. <laughs> of course, she would be like... Bro, I don't smell stinky. I smell phenomenal. Of course it gets the burn. Okay, so this is like... So they fake out. Okay. It's the fake out set. I need to play Charged again. Charged is great. Like, Charged is generally really good. There's a video on TikTok where the uh, where they crush eggs like ASMR. Because they're invasive, so they're actually doing uh, a good deed. They look like Strawberry Jam Crushed. Well, goddamn. Well, goddamn. Did some DVD and I moonwalked Michael Myers? Oh, fuck yeah. Wild thought. You get a Pokeball uh, all over you in the Pokemon world? Imagine. Imagine, Abdul. I mean, anything to get the damn fucking, like, bugged, like, the, the dragon bug. Like, why? Why Why have we not just gotten the Dragon Ball yet? Like, my god. Okay, that's concerning now. Like, that's concerning. Hmm. That was a crit. God, burn sucks. 
1K. Blizzard should do damage. It may not kill Amoongus, but it should at least start doing damage. That'd be great. Imagine not running Guts, lol. Ogapod has one ability. Well, technically two if you Terra. But it has, like, one ability. <laughs> Guts is not one of them. It would be funny, though. It would have been funny. It would have been funny. I can just Earth Power into that slot, right? I'm looking at that Entei slot. I can just Earth Power that shit, right? By Helping Hand Earth Power, even if they swap into, like, another Pokemon, like, that's gonna hurt, right? This is gonna hurt. This shit gonna hurt. Light screen? Aw, oh, you, you fool. <laughs> you fool! Hey, would you rather have Wesker call you a sussy baka or the unknown say my we smell pennies? I rather have Wesker call me a sussy baka because that shit's funny. Like that shit's just funny. Oh no, I'm too nervous to eat berries. What shall I do? Chat, what do I do? I I'm too nervous to eat berries. I'm fucked. Oh no. Aura Sphere? Ah, you fool. Freeze, it'd be really funny. Do it anyways. True, true, true. Ah, you fucking fool! Oh, la mao. Watch this shit. Do it anyways? No, 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 no. When you can't eat berries, Leon, sign women. <laughs> Th thanks, Shulk. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, buddy. Sucker punch? That's, that's so funny. Chat, no one tell him I'm about to- <laughs> No- <laughs> No one tell him I'm about to click U-turn. <laughs> it's gonna be really funny. <laughs> no one tell Mewtwo I'm about to click U-turn. Oh no, Sucker Punch. I live that shit. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh hell yeah. I mean I've given up soda. I, I'm like no longer drinking soda. I've like mostly moved on to shit like Gatorade. Like I'm trying to slowly move to just like a healthier lifestyle. Like I've replaced a lot of my snacking food with shit like peanuts and raisins and fruit. Like, that's, like, my, my go-to snack food now. I'm tr I'm trying my best, is what I'm saying. I'm, I'm trying my best. And the best way I can go at it is just flat-out removing soda and things like that from, like, my diet. Obviously, I'll have it on, like, a cheat day. But, like, only, like, one. I, I, I'm trying my best to just remove it just flat-out. I'm trying, you know, I'm, I'm trying. It's, it's, it's a progress, you know? Yeah, like, I, I'm 
trying my best to get back into shape. Like, I'm not, like, I'm just trying to be get back to, like, average. Uh, like, an average build is, like, my goal. Like, I, I don't, like, I don't expect to ever be fit fully again. I forgot about Turbo Blaze. I'm pretty sure that's just Mold Breaker, right? Like, that's just another... Yeah, it's, it's just, like... It's just a form of Mold Breaker. Kinda. Hey, welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Ugh. Urshifu, Tornadus, Blaziken, uh, Comfey, Ogapon, and Fluttermane. I'm also going to ask you stop spamming, please. I saw, I saw. Hmm. No restricted. Blaziken is what I'm curious about. Blaziken's the Pokemon I'm, like, super curious on how that's going to go. Hmm. Do I start Flutter? That's like in my head. I, I I'm just debating. Do I start Flutter? I could bring Curem, but the chances of them like going for Tailwind Tur One are extremely likely. And I think because of that. I want to do Ogapon. Because if they start Urshifu, I can just follow me. Thank you. I appreciate it. Because if I do follow me, I, like, eat Ogapon hits for days. That's... Because, like, they can cl click close combat, but, you know, Intimidate's gonna... Yeah, okay, it's, it's standard kind of set. Nothing crazy. I think two rock slides honestly might kill. Like, I kind of want to go for rock slide. Nah, okay, it's just not very effective. I'm just going to go for Terra Blast. Hmm. Or do they protect Urshifu? They could protect Urshifu. That is a genuine thing they could go for is protect Urshifu. Hail is beautiful. I would heavily disagree. <laughs> I am okay at best. I am a 4 out of 10. Alright, let's give this a shot. No protect. Oh, they're going for bleak win. They're going for bleak win. Okay, so this is kind of... So, like, Tornadus is just go for... You have Hurricane. Oh. Okay, then. Alright. Okay. I do Why would you run Hurricane over Bleak Wind? Unless you're running a rain team, is what I'm thinking. Right? If you're running rain... But, like, it, I just realized Bleak Wind also... Just run Bleak Wind. Why are you running Hurricane? Like, you're Tornadus. You're not there to do damage. You're just there to, like... Just do some, like... Like, you're just gonna, like, fucking... I don't know. I don't know. My brain is like, but why? But why? I don't know. You're a hundred out of ten? No, that's just a flat out lie. Okay, we eat that. Terra Blast should kill. Because uh we're we're a uh Yeah, it's it's not the bulky set. Doesn't got a lot of bulk. I'm just saying, you can keep sending out Pokemon. Comfey. Bet. 
<laughs> Bet. Bro, watch him go for, like, floral healing or some shit. How did Draining Kiss go first? How much priority does that thing, like, give? Like, I want to know. How much priority does its healing, like, ability... Like, what is it? Triage? Or whatever? I don't know. I know it's, I, it's like, some weird name. How does, like... How much priority? Triage is plus three? God. That's insane. That's insane. Also, uh, GG. Pokemon Unite PTSD kicking in. I mean, it's funny you say that. We're streaming Pokemon Unite Friday. I know this because my Fakemon has this specifically for Horn Leech. Oh god. Yeah, Umi and I we're uh, we're doing Unite uh Friday. La Mao. Don't worry, it's ground fairy, no stab. You should make it grass fairy, just because that'd be funny. But you're, you know, you're, you're in the smart side for not making it stab. If that was a stab thing, like, oh my god, that'd have been insane. Right. Good lord. Like, imagine having that strong of, like, an ability with, like, a lot of drain moves. Like, that'd be crazy. Ah, thanks. Thanks, Pokemon. Ground Fairy because it's a moose plus force, force spirit. Valid, valid. Give it, just give it, like... <laughs> What you do, Adam, is you give it a modified version of triage, but instead it's just only plus one priority, but it does 1.2 on grass moves. <laughs> That's because it's funny. Uh, this is a regulation B team, if I've ever seen one. I guess we're also technically regulation D, because Arcanine, but you you know what I'm saying. You get, you get what I'm cooking. You get what I'm sniffing, what I'm... Saying. I mean, fair, fair. I'm just, I'm just throwing shit out there that could be funny. Like you're already doing dumb shit. Like you're having fog, you know. Like, I'm just saying. Uh. I, I mean, I can maybe give it that a look see. Uh, I, can, I can probably give Storyteller a look see. Doesn't look like particularly my type of game, but I can I can give it a look see at some point. Did you like my new ability I posted? Uh, I didn't see it yet. I didn't read what it does. You know what else is funny? Urshifu existing. Shit, you're right. You're right. You're right. Wait, is there no psychic terrain? Oh. I see. There's there is no there's no psychic terrain. There is there is no psychic terrain. Huh? Where's the psychic terrain? Hi, Pikachu. There's no terrain. Where's the terrain? Like there is none. It's gone. Also, oh, I'm just I'm just gonna click protect, just in case. But if this one doesn't rely on psychic terrain, rock slide. What are you cooking, buddy? So, 
if you don't run, if you don't run Psychic Terrain, the other abilities are Synchronize and Own Tempo. There's no reason not to run Psychic Terrain. Like, there's no reason not to. Which is the part that's just getting me. Why? I ate the terrain? Ah, shit. Basically, in double battle, if the male version's in the field, uh, field with the female Pokemon on your side, you get plus special attack. If the female version's in the field with the male one, you get plus special defense. Ah. Nice, Adam. Like, in my brain, it's just like there's no reason not to run it. Little Timmy saw strategies but doesn't know how to use them. I guess. Like, he's gonna click Eruption. And it's gonna hurt. Like, it's, go it's gonna fucking hurt. I can say that much. But yeah, that was, that was gonna hurt no matter what. We got Snow up, but at what cause? How many more turns of Trick Room do we have to deal with? That's the question. Two? Alright. Hmm. If I could somehow live, which I doubt it, but quick use bright powder <laughs> true true remember dealing with a leaf yawn that comboed with torkoal that's silly hi star pocket sand me throw yo yo we have a chance gamers we have a chance We have a chance! Play Storyteller, I'll mail you a pipe bomb. That is a that is an interesting way to go to go for that. That is, a, that is an interesting uh synopsis there. How is everyone? I'm doing pretty solid. I we're just kind of vibing playing some Pokemon, all that good shit. Yeah, he's still clicking eruption. Huh. Interesting, Pikachu. What's up, Star? What's up, man? Alright, Trick Room's over, thank God. <laughs> All I needed to see. All I needed to see. Yeah, we should be fine now. <laughs> and yes, the Leafeon does have a white herb. That's so funny. What's a show you watch back when you appreciate it now more than before? Hmm, that's an interesting question. Um... It's a very interesting question, actually. Hmm. What is a show I appreciate more? Hmm. I would say... Hmm. Shit, what would be a good one? I would say probably regular show, because, like, I only watched a few episodes... Like, around the time it first started, right? Only a few. And, but, when I, like, turned 20, I watched a regular show. Like, 20, I think it was, like, either 20 or 21. One of those two ages. I might have been, I think, I, I want to lean towards it was more like when I was around 20. I watched a regular show, 
And I would say watching regular show fully for the first time as a 20-year-old was probably the best decision I could. I don't, I don't know. It's just, like, one of those, like, things where, like, I am very much just, like, I feel like you can very much appreciate it better as a, uh, well, as an adult. I don't know. What do we, what do we got here? Hmm, what do we, what do we got here? We got, go <laughs> we got Godzilla, but we put, but, <laughs> LLA are in brackets. That's funny. All right, Superior, Rillaboom, Tentacruel, Kyogre, Maridon, and Archaladon. Also, average YouTube commenter. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> oh, base, true. True. YouTube com YouTube streams try not to be unhinged challenged. Difficulty impossible. Um what was their good leads? I'd say probably Oga Pond's a really solid lead for us. We'll do that. For me it's either King of the Hill or Metal Apocalypse. Nice, nice. I mean, the tentacruel here is kind of rad, all right? Tentacruel is kind of silly. It's kind of... Oh, my God. God, I was like... Ugh. Rillaboom March out on. All right. So, I'm debating. Because there's a few ways we can go at this. Thank you for the hydrate. Imagine if you got defeated by this team. I mean, there's a high chance I do. Like, there's a high chance I do just kind of get destroyed by this simply because of the fact, like... There is a genuine chance, is what I'm saying. Because of just the team itself. How the hell can chat make you sick from Hydrate Redeem? The first time I had my Hydrate Redeem, chat genuinely made me sick. And how they did it was they pretty much just kept redeeming it nonstop. Which, if you drink a fuck ton of water in rapid succession, I'm talking like four bottles of water it genuinely can make you sick like there is such a thing as too much water it's a lot of water to get there but it is a genuine thing terra water terra blast that's interesting that's interesting i could still i could still do this this doesn't look too bad this still looks very winnable. It's more unfortunate than anything, but it still looks winnable. What are you gonna, what are you gonna call, man? What are you gonna call, Star? Oh, they're gonna get rid of my fucking snow. My fucking snow! You bitch! I needed that. You suck. Anyway, get out of here. By the way, chat, we do have new emotes. Uh, I didn't mount it yesterday, but we do have new ones. If you guys got that Prime Gaming and or uh, want to subscribe, we do have some new ones you guys can get a around with. You getting defeated by this team? I mean, we should still be fine. I'm not necessarily too worried. I'm not. I'm not. All right, they use Terra. I know that. Fuck! 
I swapped the lock. Oh, I thought I pressed B. 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 Oh, I pressed B. No! No! Oh, I thought I pressed B. No! 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 One second, I'll go get water. One second, I'll go get my water bottle. chat sorry about that all right i got my water bottle hail among us twerk emo is one of the emotes of all time all right one two three four five yeah and that's why you guys should subscribe is what i'm saying you know well you guys aren't subscribed what do you uh what are you losers? Huh. Uh, thank you for the hydrates. Oh, this is awesome. This is generally great. Origin pulse, amazing. Hey, no, uh, subscribe, Lamau XD. All right, we take a little bit of HP back. So you could have Protect. That Kyogre could have Protect. But we'll risk it. <laughs> Five, Five dollars a month, well. Or be the first tier three, I don't know, you know. I, no one's ever given me a tier three, you know. No one's ever given me a tier three before. I'm just saying. <laughs> it's funny. It's fine. I'm being goofy. I'm being funny. How much is tier three? It's like 25 a month. It's like pretty much like you only ever want to do a tier three to a, a, a streamer you really support kind of thing. Yo, Adam with the Prime Gaming. Thank you so much, my dude. Enjoy the emotes. Thank you so, so much. I'm just going to go for the, the Blizzard. I forgot Prime could do that. Yeah, if you got that Prime Gaming, you get a free sub a month. If you guys haven't used your sub already, I mean, you know, I'm, I'm like right here. I'm just saying. The nice thing to have, you know. The one that I wanted it to hit. Get a freeze. Damn. Yeah, it's superior is plus six. We're fucked. Uh we Do we take those? I we take those y'all lost yeah but I have the great internet because that's clearly not a me issue so I'm gonna take it as he got DC'd and we take those now I was going to lose however he's the one that DC so like I'm just saying you know he lost that he lost that what a sick joke Oh my god. <laughs> you just lost April Fools. I saw a me I saw a meme yesterday. Like did y'all see the Minecraft fucking April Fools patch? 
where they added the coolest thing ever and someone made a meme where it's like April Fools, like a dude like looking smug and saying it and then pointing at a thing saying the coolest shit ever. <laughs> I posted that on Discord yesterday. It's like, oh my god, they really added a genuinely really cool feature and said April Fools, fuck you. Oh my god. Hey, could someone in the YouTube chat just spam uh, for a bit? Uh, because, you know, uh, for whatever reason, the YouTube chat just brings the most unhinged motherfuckers ever. Take care, Star. Like, what's with the YouTube chat and generally just being unhinged? It's insane. Like, it's like, th skull emoji? Thank you, Blade. Thank you for, thank you. Like, it's generally, like, why are- why is everyone so unhinged? Like, it's genuinely just insane. Who am I more worried about? I mean, yeah, I'm sure there's, like, some unhinged Instagram stuff as well. But I'm talking like live streaming wise, YouTube comments for whatever reason are just genuine. Like the YouTube chat will end up like either being filled with children, which by the way, we do have a policy. Uh, anyone below 16 gets fucking out of here. I can't stop y'all from watching VODs, but I'm definitely not letting y'all watch live. And if you are under 16 and you don't want us to catch you, don't fucking say shit. Like, oh my God. It's, like, so easy, but yet, like, little Timmy is, like, which, hey, helps us get rid of y'all, so, you know, lum out. The fuck you mean you're cute, Charm? The hell you mean? The fuck? What the fuck? I'm just gonna do this. Play the LeBron James meme. Yeah, put up like uh, uh, me, me and the kids watching a little Tom and Jerry before school. <laughs> I love that. That just post so much. Just LeBron looking dead inside. Be like, we watched a little bit of Tom and Jerry in the morning. It's like LeBron, are you being held at gunpoint? What's going on, buddy? <laughs> he looks so dead inside. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> oh my god. Nice, Zack. Hell yeah, man. Now I click Ivy Cudgel, I murder everything, and I say GG. Like, it's just very funny. I, I, I don't know why. I don't know why. Just YouTube chat will say, like, I'm gonna put a pipe bomb, play game, or I put pipe bomb in your mailbox. I'm dead, si dead, fucking serious. And it's like, you okay, buddy? You all right? You okay, man? Did you not get attention enough attention from mommy as a kid? Like, is that what's going on? Like, I can't help you there, but like, you know, it'll, it'll, it'll get better, man. It'll get better. Things will get better, you know? Oh my God. Uh, I'm gonna assume the game. That's what I would assume. Would you rather remove Among Us from reality or Skibbity, Skibbity Toilet? Mm, that is the question of all time. Oh, that's kind of hard. Ah. Ah. 
Like, you might just instantly think I'm gonna say Skibbity, but like, Skibbity Toilet to me is now at the rank of where Big Chungus was, right? Where Big Chungus, for the longest time, was the most unfunny shit on the planet to me. Like, I never understood why Big Chungus was funny. I was like, what? what's funny about this? It's just a fat bug's bunny. But then, because... Because of the fact... That it was so unfunny, it became fucking hilarious to me. And the my stance on Skibbity Toilet is like... I kind of like what it stands for, right? The fact that, like, Gmod is, like, kids are now, like, seeing Gmod and stuff. Like, n modern kids. Like, it's cool. I, I like the fact that, you know, like, something from our childhood is now being shared with the next generation. But it's also Skibbity Toilet. But I also kind of appreciate it in a way. And I don't know, my brain is kind of maybe leaning towards Among Us. Like, I don't know. Both are, like, very, like, similar funny levels to me. So I, I, I might just say Among Us because I actively piss my friends off when I start spewing off about Skibbity Toilet. And it's kind of funny. I don't know. I, I think I gotta say Skibbity Toilet. Which is the funniest thing I've ever said. It's like Lola Mal. <laughs> Someone send Hale a toilet? I'm not asking for a toilet. I'm just saying like... I don't know. I find, I find this shit kind of funny. Like, is it unhinged? Oh, without a doubt. But like... I don't know, man. Like, the thing with Skibbity Toilet to me is, I think Skibbity Toilet itself, like, if you take the videos on face value without, like, you know, if you take it at face value, I think think it's not that big of a deal and again i'm saying like face value as in like just skibbity toilet itself kind of thing and i don't know it's just it's just one of those things where like i i can't i can't hate it like there's just a part of me where i just can't hate it I, I feel like I'm about to get hit by a taunt. So I'm gonna be honest, like... I'm gonna say Among Us. I'd rather have Among Us removed than Skibbity Toilet. Because, again, part of me, like, just kind of respects it. I don't know. Again, a part of me. Where is the two week notice? <laughs> Listen, man, again, it's just one of those things where like, I don't know, it's, it's a hard question. Like, I understand if people don't like Skibbity Toilet. I understand it, right? But to me, it's just like the fact that something from our generation can become as popular as it's become in the modern generation. Like, I, I don't know. I just think that's kind of neat, you know? I think it's kind of neat. Sue me. <laughs> hmm. Why skibbity when you can newt newt? Shit, you're right, you're right. I don't know. It, 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 it's a hard question. It's a hard question. Because in my brain, like, both, it could go either way. It genuinely could go either way for me.
And I already know someone's probably gonna clip this shit and be like, this, this motherfucker's stupid. And I'm like, I mean, yeah. But I don't know, there's just a part of me that kind of respects it. I don't know, just... I don't know, I don't know. Ow. Owie. I said I liked Skibbity Toilet and now I'm getting hit. What the fuck? This thing's gonna be a fucking problem. Skibbity Manga. Oh. Again, I don't know. It's just one of those things. Oh. Oh lord, what did you DM me, Blade? Why is there an Anthro Vaporeon in my fucking DMs? What did you send me? What did you send me? What are you trying to send me? What is this shit? God, that did nothing to this thing! I'm a chi you. Oh my god! It's alive! What the fuck? God, this thing's bulky as hell! Good god! Icy lobby? Oh god. Thanks, Shulk. Thanks, Shulk. This calls for Paul. I mean, Paul. Paul's always here, man. Paul's always here. You can never escape Paul. Like, Paul's always thriving. No matter what we do, Paul's always here in our hearts. Yo, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Ow! The fuck, Shulk? The hell did I do to you? Okay, Snow's back. Let's see. How you doing, uh, Zero Rhythm? What do they have? Name Zero? I, I, I did assume so. How you doing, man? Uh, you exist? Clearly. Clearly. <laughs> Rock Slide... Rock Slide might not be the play. I think I gotta go Stomping Tantrum. Ugh. So one Pokemon I have problem fighting is Dracovish with Vicious Rend. If you're if we're, if you're having an issue with Dracovish, uh, run Freeze Dry. Freeze Dry is four times effective against Dracovish. Just run a fast Pokemon that has access to Freeze Dry. Uh, if you're having a problem outspeeding Dracovish, throw something with Tailwind on your team. Fuck. Do I just click Blizzard and hope for the best? Well... Full si Okay, thank god I clicked Blizzard. Thank god. I kind of had a feeling. Ready for regulation pain? I, I wouldn't say this is regulation pain. I'm honestly at least like on the casual ladder, which I have been lu lucky to find a lot of like... I've been lucky to find a lot of people running regulation... Um, Regulate well, re regulation G teams uh, on the ladder, and it's been fun so far. Mostly still trying to learn how to pilot this team properly. How are you doing, Kennedy? Like, are you a VGC player or a uh, doubles player? Uh, like a, a, a VGC player or a Smogon player? Zero. Hunting shiny Kyogre in Dynamax Adventures? Nice, nice. 
Oh, so that's unfortunately GG. Losing, losing the... Lo losing the, the snow definitely uh, was very unfortunate. Running Kyogre, I see. Very, uh, very creative. Daring, I see. Are you playing uh, Sword and Shield doubles? Is that what you're playing? I'm just trying to like gather like the the mindset of like like the format and all of that in my head. Hmm. God, shout out the water. Shout out to water. But yeah, this is the team we're running, Kurem. Oh, not Kurem. Kennedy. We're running, we're running Kurem White. We're running a Kurem White snow team. I've been playing it while well, my friend's console was brother was doing an online fight. And I had to fight against Dracovish. If that's the case, like I said, uh, freeze dry is your best option. Uh... Especially if you're in doubles, uh, Tornadus and or Whimsicott with Tailwind so you outspeed the Vish. Because the main thing is obviously outspeeding Vish. Uh, if you, like, pretty much, like, do some calcs, figure out the max speed of Vish, level 50. Um, and find something that has Freeze Dry and just outspeed it. Because Freeze Dry will, it'll, it'll take care of your Vish problem. So we in Lilligant, Torkoal, Gengar based. Oh uh Oranguru, Dadunsparce, and Obeliva. Alrighty. Can I talk about how like I genuinely believe um Like I gen I, I g personally genuinely believe that <sighs> It's hard to say this with a with a without smiling on my face. I personally wholeheartedly believe that Gengar needs to get Levitate back. I think Gengar is now just been outclassed by so many ghost types, like Fluttermane and Goldango, that I think it needs Levitate back. Because, like, that was its, it was its thing. And Cursed Body, like, it's not a bad ability, but... Flutterman and Gold Dango exist. There's no reason to run run it over like cuz like they gave a curse body to nerf Gengar. I get it. But it's been long enough to where I genuinely do think, yeah, no, I think it's I think it's time we give it levitate back. Because Gengar right there. Look at look at Gengar right there. Look at that little guy. Look at that little little man. I can click stomping tantrum and fucking kill this thing. And that's exactly what I'm going to click. You also just Draco meter onto like the 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 Dunsparce. So it's going to be like really funny. But like, yeah, I I I I do think it's time to give it levitate back. Like, genuinely, because because to me it's like, but why? But why? Okay. Interesting. Oh, this is stored power. Wait, you're... Huh? Okay. Okay. Uh, I mean, I just find... I, I don't stream Showdown because, to me, I I rather have the game look nicer and have chances of just running into, like, casual teams than use, like... Than, than, than use Showdown. That's just entirely a me thing, though. Like, I, 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 I try to, like... Also, no chat box. True, true. I don't feel like dealing with showdown players. Like, you know, I know it's a der her showdown players all toxic, but like, generally, I just don't want to deal with showdown players. 
I I don't I don't feel like it, Chief. I don't feel like it. You bitch! I forgot you had a Torkoal. You know what? That's fair. Okay. Tragic. I'm trying to get my veil up. I mean, at the very least, this is gonna hurt more. Cause like I can kind of click Dark Pulse into literally any of these Pokemon, and it's going to hurt. I just click Helping Hand. I click Dark Pulse. It kind of just hurts them. Like there's nothing wrong with Showdown. I I do like use Showdown for a like I I use Showdown to obviously be like team build and prep here and there, but I don't like streaming showdown simply because of the fact that you know there are chat boxes which for me anytime there's an online game with chat boxes that shit gets turned off so fast like so fast i not dealing with chat boxes oh you want to lock me into the helping hand encore bet bet I'm not going to complain. I was going to click Dark Pulse no matter... <laughs> I was going to click Dark Pulse no matter what. So... <laughs> he just locked me into fucking helping hand Dark Pulse. <laughs> you know... <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. By the way, there is a battle queue as a reminder, chat. I do have that open. If not, obviously, we'll continue, like, we'll continue to do this. It's just, oh, my God. That's so funny. Oh, my God. That's so funny. What is this? Oh, God. Ditto's going to get used again. Oh, that's right. Oh, Ditto's gonna get used again because it's, it's a shit. Yeah, no, Ditto's Ditto's gonna have its use again in VGC. So for those unaware, uh, Ditto is used in a lot of restricted formats to get more restricted Pokemon, especially in a format where like, yeah, I don't know why the male and Didi. I don't know why like there's a male and Didi, but. I could still work with this. This is this is fine. Like, I look at this, and I'm like, it should be fine. The main thing that concerns me is the Calyrex. That's the big thing. Because Calyrex, I've yet to fight a, a Calyrex with this team. And Calyrex Shadow Rider is going to be another prominent Pokemon. Also, hi, Sam. Calyrex! <sighs> Why isn't its signature move, like, 80% accuracy? Like, honestly. Imagine bringing Magikarp and Ditto transforms into Magikarp. That would be funny. Okay, somewhat similar leads. Alright, alright, alright. Nodders, nodders. Beads of Ruin are about to hurt a fuck ton. Tailwind, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, I don't remember if beads stack. It looks like it probably does. I'm going to assume by that damage, it probably does. 
I have no idea, but like I'm gonna that's a lot of damage. So maybe. <laughs> hmm. Don't be Calyrex. Urshifu Dark, okay. That's not too bad. Could have been worse. A fighting move's gonna come my way. Which, that's extremely unfortunate. They could just be 252 specs overheat. I, I, I mean, yeah, the heat wave. It could have been. Should have bust out the flex tape. Shit, you're right, you're right, you're right. You're right, you're right. Can never assume. Can never assume. Losing Chi Yu does kind of suck. But. We're bulky now. So. We could be fine. We'll see. We will see. We are decently bulky. <laughs> God, that still does a lot of damage. So it's trying to be a better Articuno team. Kinda, except unlike Articuno, uh, I can click other moves. Like, I'm not running like one-to-one -one the Articuno team. But, like I said, unlike Articuno, uh, I am able to run other moves with Kiram White. And instead of, like, choice specs, which I am maybe considering choice specs instead. Like, I'm still experimenting, and which is why, you know, we're doing practice and all of that. Who needs better moves? Shit, you're right. Articuno winning that regional was still the coolest thing ever. Like, and I don't mean it in the pun way, but, like, generally that shit was awesome. Especially when it was four ice moves and one of them was sheer cold. That was so awesome. That was genuinely awesome. Oh my god. Oh. Uh. Oh my lord. Hmm. Hear me out, lock on to sheer cold. I mean you could, you could. I'm pretty sure lock on does still work with all those. Okay. Hmm, this this is a two 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 team. The Curum set is Blizz it's it's Blizzard, Draco Meteor, Earth Power Protect, because it's a life orb. If I were to run choice choice specs, it would be uh I would run freeze dry. Like I, I, I would run freeze dry. Hmm. Which I am kind of considering doing a choice specs. That is something I am considering. Because, like, I would run Choice Scarf, because Scarf would be really nice on Kyurem, but I am running it on Landorus, and with Landorus, it is kind of necessary. So, with this being a 2 2 2 team, I'm thinking their lead might be Lando. Might be. Which, if it's Lando. Not Lando, um. Chi Yu Dragonite might be their lead. It's either going to be Chi Yu Dragonite or Tornado. I don't think they start Calyrex. I I don't think they start Calyrex.
We will see. Never mind, I guess I do. This is horrifying. This is the most like fuck. Like genuinely just fuck situation. Cause if that if that Calyrex gets one fucking kill, it's Jover. It's genuinely Jover. I want Bale so badly, but it's going to outspeed. This is the most aggressive lead you could do. Like, Chiyu Calyrex is horrifying. Like, I'm doing this straight for the boost and also the fact that I see, like, a Chiyu right there. Okay, they don't tear on Chiyu. That's kind of what I was, like... Waiting to see if they did. Which they don't. And also, I just want to get rid of this fucking Calyrex. I want to get rid of the Calyrex so badly. Like, Calyrex literally just, like, murders my team if I don't get rid of it. Fuck! Okay, I can breathe a little better, a little better. Not a huge amount better, but enough. Chien Pao? Okay. We're so Barack! <laughs> I need to get Veil. I think I can get a Veil. Maybe. I'm gonna have to risk it. I want the veil so badly. They have Dragonite in the back. That's the good thing to know. They have Dragonite. Like, that's huge. Knowing that the Pokemon in the back is Dragonite is genuinely, like, huge. Fuck! Sacred Sword. Alright, you take chip damage, break any potential sash. What's my play? What's my play? What's my play? Chiyu's gonna have Sacred Sword, which still hurts. Chiyu's just gonna keep clicking moves is, like, my issue. It's gonna keep clicking buttons. There isn't really much I can do other than fucking hope to get rid of the Chiyu. That's kind of like... Again, I'm looking at this. I'm like, the only way I see us genuinely winning this is if we get rid of that fucking Chiyu. Which, getting rid of Chiyu is hard. Sacred Sword? Eat? Fuck. Oh, right. Yeah, it ignores shit. That's so tragic. That was the most aggressive lead I've ever seen in my life. Like, holy shit. Dude was speed running that. Tragic. A speed ran that one. Caloric Shadow Rider is just the mon of all time.
Like, when that thing starts to just, like, gen like gets, like, a kill, the dominoes start spinning. And I think, like, it was Moxie who said dark types are mandatory in this format, and I honestly genuinely believe. I, like, I fully fucking agree with that. Because Calyrex is going to be top five, possibly top three again. Like, Calyrex is just that good. <laughs> it's... It's such a strong Pokemon. Dark type Fluttermane, genuinely... Genuinely, which is the funniest thing. Like, when that thing just gets the chance to set up, it's scary. It is genuinely scary. What is this guy cooking? He is he's got a Kyogre, so I'm leaning Ogapon, but he is cooking. He is this man this man got in the fridge. This guy's got a game plan. I respect it. I do respect it. I'm just very curious what he's cooking. Like, all of those are good. Like, Calyrex Ice, like, Calyrex Ice, I think, is also, like, underappreciated. Hmm. Okay, Girl Snow Gomora. Oh, it does. Like, it's generally such aggressive Pokemon. Hey, Soul. Rush. How you doing, Soul? Hmm. Do they run fake out? Or are they doing, like, screens? They could just be screens. It could just be screens. We'll see. We'll see. It's screens. That's fine. That's so tragic. Hmm. What do I do here? I got it up. I go... I mean, if I just start clicking Blizzard, it should work out. Damn, Glamora is like hanging on. Wait, what the fuck? Wait, what? What? The hell you mean you're not toxic debris? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. You're... You're running corrosion. You're running corrosion over toxic debris. What the fuck? What the fuck? Yeah, it has a second ability. It has corrosion for its hidden ability. I'm here being like... Huh? What? What does it do? Corrosion lets you poison poison and uh, steel types. But here's the thing. there You should never run corrosion over toxic debris. Because first of all, toxic spikes, you want to set up toxic spikes? Run toxic to that's not that's not intimidate Gyarados. That's not intimidate Gyarados. What what is what is this bro cooking? What is he cooking? What is this man cooking and can I have some? 
Like, generally, you should never run Corrosion on a Glamora. You run Toxic Debris. There is no reason not to run Toxic Debris. That is free spikes. Even if you die, that's free spikes. Uh, yeah, it would be... If, it, if it's not... Like, if it's not, uh, Intimidate, it, it is Moxie. It's a mo it's a Moxie Gyarados. Gyarados gets Temper Flare? Huh? Wait, this thing gets Temper Flare? Oh my god, it got Temper Flare. I mean, it makes sense. It's like, huh? Huh? I'm not saying it doesn't make sense. It's more like, huh? Huh? I just gotta keep clicking horn leads to try and live. Ah, shit. You know, I'll, I'll bring in nine tails. I'll bring in nine tails. Hmm. Oh, wait, Kyogre. All right. Never mind. I look, I look over because, like, I saw some inc important EQ stuff that was, like, being talked about just to try and take care of that. I know, very professional streamer. I look over and I see Kyogre. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> I click Horn Leech. Dude, if there's one thing I could tell this guy. Get the fuck off Corrosion. <laughs> use your, hit it, use your, like... Oh, yeah, no, Ogapon, like, literally hard counters uh, Kyogre. It's great. Oh, yeah, and it also does great as well, because, like, you can Terra, because, you know, you can you can eat some hits, all that good stuff. Good stuff, good stuff. Ooh, okay, all right, I get to explain this now. So, for those unaware, uh, Chien Pao Rei Rei is probably going to need, is probably going to become kind of a thing. Because, you know, uh, <laughs> Rayquaza gets E-Speed. Uh, it also gets Swords Dance. So, uh, Rayquaza is pretty much bulky Dragonite. That's, that's, that's Rayquaza's thing. It's bulky Dragonite. Uh, Clear Amulet is pretty likely as well. Uh, yeah, no, Farigaraf is just cooking. Like, Farigaraf eats every time. Fur Farigaraf just eats every time. As for their lead, I do see Chien Pao leading. So if they run Chien Pao, I could probably run Ogapon. Yeah, I can run Ogapon and do that. Or even do that. Yeah, all right, let's give that a shot. But yeah, no, like, like it requires this very silly, very silly guy. And Frigoraph stocks are just like, they don't go down. They only go up. It genuinely feels like they literally just go up. It, it's so funny. All right, clear amulet. It's clear amulet. All right. All right, they watch Moxie. <laughs> Mo Moxie literally talked about this in like their latest video. They, yeah, they want, they want. Figraph looks better with each regulation. It genuinely does. Time to upper hand. <laughs> Shit, you right.
I was debating my head what I wanted to do. It's gonna like, I mean, upper hand was introduced literally just to be another account, like counter. If I had a Pokemon that could run upper hand, I generally would probably just throw it on for the sake of throwing it on. It's very funny. Oh yeah, no, it gets actual flying stab, which is better than dragon stab. But, like in this scenario, you want to run it better. That's so funny. Right. I forgot. I forgot. I I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. Requaza's ability is Cloud Nine. I forgot. Chat. Point and laugh. Not Cloud Nine's airlock. I forgot. Chat. I forgot. Point and laugh at the fish. I forgot. I forgot. They're not dead. Snow teams aren't dead. Listen, we're not Sandstorm, all right? Oh, yeah. It's a bit, it's anti-weather. Oh, yeah. Crit mattered there. <laughs> crit mattered. Crit fucking mattered. Rayquaza, yeah, no, Rayquaza shuts down weather, which it's like, you know, that's, uh, this is not very, uh, nice of it to do. Like, I think it's kind of rude that you would shut down weather like that. Like, what the fuck? You know, like, come on, bro. But. Rillaboom? Oh, we work with this. We work with this. I'm gonna protect. I'm just gonna protect for the sake of like fake out. You know, Ray Ray just gets sent out, blocks weather, I cry. Fuck! I could have gotten the the freest blizzard of my life. I'm so upset. I could have gotten the freest blizzard of my life. God, I'm so upset. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm not angry. I'm not angry. I'm very fucking angry. I'm actively lying to you. Okay, what do you have in the back? Alright, terror, terror. Or flying's not the worst. Doesn't matter of what do I would be locked into. I guess Terra Blast is good on just everything. It's just good on everything. But now Mega Requ like no Mega Requ Requaz is like actually probably gonna be like good again because i don't think was Rayquaza used during gen 8 i don't think i ever saw a Rayquaza team hey drago how you doing it's been a second like i don't remember Rayquaza ever getting used in like gen 8 damn if i can i'm doing good just playing pokemon hell yeah hell yeah good shit Ice ca was good with Ray. Gotcha. Of course, Rayquaza dodges it. Why would it not? Why would it not? Fuck me, man. Yeah, I mean, that's the big thing. It's actually able to eat hits now. Fuck, man. Literally told my snow to die. Bruh. Bruh. Oh. Well, you know, it's, uh, it is what it is, you know. It's all good. <laughs> nice, Drago. I hope that goes well for you, man.
Right, let me answer a DM real quick. Hold on. Let's see. I'm gonna lie, I think it might be back to go to the drawing board. Nah, I think I can still work with this. If anything, I think I just replaced Life Orb. If anything, I do think I just replaced Life Orb. I just go full for damage. Just Flutterman? Yeah, yeah, yeah. True, 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 true. True, 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 true. True, true, true. Hmm. So they're probably going to do the exact same lead, which if they do... Weather's pretty much pointless. I think I just don't bring my restricted. Yeah, I don't think I bring the restricted. I think there's another way to go at this. Okay. Different lead. I can work with this. Honestly, not a bad lead. Um, because I mean, I just. I can kind of just go for Protect, Chi Yu, and Dazzling Gleam. Like, I look at this, I'm like, ah, yes, Dazzling Gleam, my beloved. That's a free ass Dazzling Gleam. Hey, Voxel, how you doing? Free ass dazzling gleam. Grassy glide. Ow. Oh, of course it was crit. Of course it was crit. Hurt my feelings with that one. I'm gonna ask you, don't do that again, buddy. Like, that was kind of mean. The D Gleam did nothing. It was it didn't do nothing. It did damage. You gotta have faith, man. You gotta have faith. You gotta have faith. Parting shot? Bet. What do we got? What do we got here? Ray Ray, Chien Pao? Ray Ray, gotcha. The big thing right now is Flutter can ignore the E speed. Because obviously, Ghost. If I can get rid of the Rillaboom, we'll be fine. Now, I am Sashed. So, if I do Terra Fire, Heat Wave, assuming that Rayquaza is going to go for Terra Normal, I can live one E speed and hopefully do a good chunk before going down. So let's see. I can eat a E speed. Okay. He didn't tear a normal. We can take those. 
If we can get a burn, that'd be huge. I'm just saying. Crit? You know what? Not a burn. I will take it, though. Well, damn, Voxel. Damn. Kinda rude. Ensign. Welcome back, buddy. Ooh. Oh, I know what I can do here. I know what I can do here. <laughs> There's the Terra Normal. There you are. Uh, excuse me. Yeah, I knew that was kind of coming. That was coming. Get a little bit of recovery back. They get recovery back now that they're no longer technically flying. Okay, uh, the E-Speed's gonna be coming on to... Uh, yeah, the E-Speed's gonna be going on to... You. Okay. If they do click E-Speed, they could always just click Dragon Ascend or Dragon Dance. I'm gonna do this. Okay, Rock Slide, if I get a flinch, that'd be huge. Fuck. Fuck. Oh, I totally get a Flare Blitz the Flutter Bane. No. Tragic. I got outplayed. I'm also just not good at the game. <laughs> Okay, what's my game plan now? Um, I guess, like, just keep going for spread moves and hope for the best. Because eventually, like, they can only, only, like, they don't have spread moves of their own. They only really can target one at a time. So it's more of like, well, just hope they don't pick the one I want them to, you know? I have Ogapon in the back. If I can just get rid of the Ray Ray. Ray Ray's the big one. Okay, you know what? That's that's kind of the one I wanted them to go for. Because Chi Yu, I think, might be able to do something. Please fucking burn. Oh my god. Chi Yu, please. Please fish. Yeah, so the Re the Rayquaza set is a bulky Rayquaza set with clear amulet, E speed, Dragon Ascend, Sword Stance, Protect. That's the set. That's that's the set going around for like Chien Pao shenanigans. Hold on. Wait a moment. Fuck. I was hoping to... Damn it! I was hoping to call an E-Speed. I was hoping to call an E-Speed there. Damn it! it that actually would have killed. I feel like the only way I genuinely could somehow come back from this is just go for another one and hope they get that 30. But then they might click it again. Fuck it. Yeah, hey, Ben. Yeah, Regulation G is, uh... Well, regu Regulation G is a one-restricted format. It is next month, so we're on the casual ladder. Please, come on. That was my only win con there. Tragic. Tragic. 
tragic. We'll get him in the next one. But yeah, it's next month that uh, it actually starts. So we're just practicing around. I'm thinking of probably swapping the choice specs for Ray Ray. Ogapon Rock could be funny. It could. However, I need a Kyogre counter. So I'm keeping Wellspring. Like, Wellspring's just more consistent. Let's try swapping uh, for Freeze Dry. Let's give that a shot. Where are you? You're in Dragon. Yee, the Meganium Raids are going on right now. I did see that. Do I have a spare choice specs? I don't. All right. Let's fly on over here real quick. Grab ourselves a lovely choice specs and then click buttons. I just kind of hope for the best. That's kind of what we're aiming for. Oh, we can really go. Oh, my God. I get it. I get it. I mean, from what I see, like, at least, like, my friends are, like, just saying bring Mew again. Because it's, like, what? Terra Psychic? Also, it's a Meganium. Like, <laughs> the thing with Meganium is I generally feel like out of all the raids, I feel like Meganium's the one where it's like, yup, that's, uh, that's a free dub. You should charge your controller now? Nah. Nah. <laughs> Don't worry, I have a spare. Oh my god. That's so funny on the timing though, holy shit. That was so funny. Nope, that's power wave. All right, let's give this a shot. Let's see how this goes. Nice Pikachu. Meganium needs fucking something. Meganium literally, like, go gets sent in and dies. Meganium doesn't... It doesn't do anything. Is like the issue Meganium has. It's like, what do you do with a Meganium? Answer: Nothing. Is <laughs> like it does. It doesn't do shit. All right, here we go. This should be interesting. Um, I mean, now that I freeze dry, I can just click freeze dry into a lot of this. Hmm. I might have to force a Terra. Let's try that. Like, in my brain, I'm just like, what's literally my best play here? I don't know. I genuinely don't know. Like, Meganium just needs a new ability. I genuinely think it's time they give it a new ability. As for which new ability... I mean, Chloroform is, like, the one that comes to mind. I know that's kind of, like, Venusaur's thing. Right? I understand. That's kind of Venusaur's thing. But... I got a shiny Munchlax? Yo, congrats, man. But, like... What else do you give Meganium that would make sense? I feel like Chloroform... Because, like, Leaf Guard is, like... 
It's an option, I guess. Thick fat? That's huge power. <laughs> I love how the entire Pokemon community is like, give it huge power. Like, that's always the Pokemon's community, like, fucking, like, say for anything. And it's kind of funny. Pure power is shit, you're right. Thick fat actually could be interesting. Though, here's the thing. How the hell did it not get Pollen Puff? Can we talk about that? Can we talk about how they could had the perfect opportunity to give Meganium Pollen Puff and they just didn't? Why? Why doesn't it get Pollen Puff? That makes so much... Oh, this sucks. Yeah, that's GG. That's actually GG right there. Because it's not a Pollen. Amoongus gets it! If Amoongus gets Pollen Puff, then fucking Meganium gets mo Pollen Puff. That's genuinely GG. I thought they were going to go for, for the Chi Yu. Uh. Yeah, it's genuinely GG. Hell, what the fuck do I do here? Yeah, and like. But like. Just how? Just give it Pollen Puff. Just give it Pollen Puff. Like, just give it Pollen Puff, man. Like, just generally, just give it Pollen Puff. Nope, time to just hope for the best. What do you have in the back? The Calyrex is the threat. Well, yeah, it's that's just that's just CG. Or give Megadium a Mega. That'd be cool. God. Calyrex, man. They really said make Calyrex's signature move fucking 100% accurate 120. Like, really? Why is Astral Barrage 120 100 accurate? Like, can we just talk? Can we just talk about that? Why? Why? Kyogre gets boosted in range, but Origin Pulse is, like, in range, but Origin Pulse is only, like, what, 85? Why? Why do you do this, Pokemon? Why? Just why? Hi, Ghost Expert here, because fuck you. Yeah, it sounds about right. That sounds like Game Freak's response for a lot of shit. I love paying $60 to win. Oh my god. Now is you just being mean. Now is you just being mean. Oh, well, that's GG. Like, I, I can't win this, man. Calyrex got set up. Like, Calyrex is just a Pokemon of all time. I'm definitely going to be messing around. I might... Like, I might honestly sub out Fluttermane. Like, Fluttermane's just nice. However, honestly, in my brain, I'm like, what if I tried for Rigorath? 
Like, my brain is like, what if I replaced Fluttermane with Throat Spray for Rigoraf? I don't know. It just popped in my head. I'm like, it could work. Hyper Voice, maybe Terra Dark for Calyrex. Actually, hold on. Hmm. That's not a bad idea. Why Terra Dark? Uh, Calyrex. Just Calyrex. You're a normal type? Yeah, but it kills Calyrex. Hmm. I might, I might, I might do a little bit of, my bit of experimenting. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Uh, I would, but I do actually have to get going now, because I do work today. So we're going to have to call it good, uh, for today. Uh, tomorrow, lads. So tomorrow... Uh, is going to be a Bakugan stream. Uh, that'll be going on quite a bit today. If you guys are on Twitch, stick around. We are going to do a raid. We're going to send you guys over to whoever on my list is live. Who's live? Uh, Yukihana. Actually, wait, no. Lego. Lego's live. Uh, <laughs> it's all a good star. Um, so, uh, to those on YouTube, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I will see you all next time.